he was, in a way, at the center of events. Perhaps as much, I think, in Paris as in New York. Even though he came from the parochial background of a small Midwestern town, he could be at ease with and enjoy contact and business connections with some of the most influential men in Europe and America. He was there controlling the levers of credit and making the world work financially at a, through some very, very stressful times. What they were looking for was they were looking for judgment and character and breadth of experience. And that was key. And Dean Jay had those things. Although he came from a, a, a Midwest background distant from, say, Jack Morgan's background, uh, he had a varied experience and he could deal with people and dealing with people was absolutely critical. His eyes were open, his heart was open when he spoke with you. You felt you were the most important person in the room. And he did that by not only looking at you, but also by listening. His career was one based on relationships. And the relationships, I think a lot of them came from the hospitality she arranged, really, and was responsible for. I know that Grandpa Jay came from humble circumstances. He was always a fabulous character at connecting to other people. So he certainly had not at all the patrician and upper class uh, prejudices of, uh, of a lot of people that would have been in his similar type of position.